to go over some of the placarding that you need for a solar system. First off, if you have a fuse disconnect, you need to label it as a service disconnect if you have line side taps. Also, your back feed has to have the operating current of your inverter and the voltage nominal listed on the disconnect. That could be your fuse disconnect or it could be a back fed breaker. Your meter should have a placard that says photovoltaic system connected. And some jurisdictions make you rivet that on. And uh, one of your outside AC disconnects should have a sign for rapid shutdown. This is so a firefighter can see quickly how to turn off the solar. And I believe it's a requirement nowadays to have rapid shutdown enabled for any solar that's on a house. That means after you turn off the system, it takes 10 or 30 seconds for the DC conductors from the roof to go under 50 volts. And again, we're labeling our photovoltaic AC disconnect and we're calling out that a firefighter could just hit this switch. This is the rapid shutdown switch. And let me go inside and show you some of the other placarding we need. In particular, some placards on the inverter and placards on the DC pipe up to the panels. So here we have our inverter. And this house had a roughed in tube to the attic. So we're labeling this as the photovoltaic power source. Also the, in the attic, there's the same stickers on the flex conduit going up to the rooftop junction box. And our inverter has first our company sticker. So if somebody has a problem, they can call us. We label the DC disconnect with a sticker and we label the DC maximum system voltage and max circuit current on the DC disconnect. If we had two strings, this would be the max parallel current, which would be 30. In our case, a solar edge system, the optimizers have 15 amp inline fuses, and so that's the maximum current per circuit of optimizers. And then one more thing is any panels should have this dual power source sticker. And that should be most of the stickers you need for a solar system. Thanks, have a great day.